Welcome to our lecture online. Here our next problem deals with the simple pendulum. And it turns out that this problem is uncharacteristically simple for a JE main test question. It's kind of a nice relief because sometimes they're not like that. So you could probably save time on this one that you'll probably need on the next one. So let's read the problem together. It says, if the time period of a two meter long simple pendulum is two seconds, the acceleration due to gravity at the place where the pendulum is executing simple harmonic motion, that's what SHM means, is, and they give us four possible answers. It's either 2 pi squared, 16, 9.8, or pi squared meters per second squared. Of course, we're dealing with the acceleration, so we have units of meters per second squared. So, what we're going to do is we're going to write the equation of a pendulum. I remember the frequency equation. Frequency is 1 over 2 pi times the square root of g over l. And since the period is equal to 1 over the frequency, that means that the period is the inverse of that, which is 2 pi times the square root of l over g. That way, I only have to remember two out of the three equations. Now, plugging in what we know, well, first of all, before we do that, uh, we're looking for g, so now we have to solve that equation for g. So we square both sides. t squared equals 4 pi squared times l over g, or g is equal to 4 pi squared l over the period squared. And now all we have to do is plug in some numbers. So we have 4 pi squared times l. l is 2 meters, so we plug in 2 divided by t, the period, which is 2 seconds, so we have 2 squared. That cancels out, so we end up with 2 pi squared, and that's meters per second squared. And notice, we do have one answer that matches that, which is answer A, and we were able to solve that in less than 3 minutes, a little time saved for the next problem, and that is how it's done. So that was an easy one. Straightforward. Straightforward.